Hello friends, in this video I'm going to install the fresh Laravel application and I'm going to add the view 3 and Inertia.js. Okay, first I'm going to open the browser, sorry, uh, Chrome browser, in my, you can open your choice. Okay, and I'm going to open the laravel.com, also Vue.js.org, and also the inertia.js.com, and in the Laravel you you know now I'm going to open the terminal. Okay, CD to the total code. I have two apps. Clear, and I'm going to create another one, Laravel new, and I'm going to name it. Laravel Inertia Hit enter and it's going to create Flash Laravel application Ok, go to the Inertia.js and Installation in the server side Ok, we have the Laravel example and rails So just copy the composer require Inertia.js Slash Inertia Laravel Ok, copy, terminal, cd to the Laravel Ok, and pass that code in Ok After that we need to Copy this and uh, I don't have the PHP store, so I'm going to open VS Code. And open file. I'm going to open the new Go then Laravel Inertia, open Ok, now in the resources, views We have the welcome view Select all, close and paste that We copy from the Inertia.js Hit save and after that, we need to run the PHP Artisan Inertia middleware. Copy, uh, go to the terminal. OK. And we need to add this as, as the last item in your web middleware group. So copy this, uh, go to the VS Code and open the kernel.php we have a middleware groups and I'm going to add at the end hit save ok creating response so here we can return inertia render and this is the event that show this show is the component. We don't have that component. So first I'm going to install the I'm 
I'm going to install the Vue.js first, so get started and uh, choose the version 3 installation npm and choose this one copy paste to the and it's going to install the npm view next okay also we need the compiler yeah okay now we need to run the npm install inertia inertia for the view 3 and in the view 3 we need to import create app from the view and also the create inertia app from the inertia js inertia view 3 okay copy this one and go to the js inside the resources js app js and remove that i don't know and paste that in and we have this create inertia app and we have resolve name is required the pages and the name okay we don't have the pages inside here so i'm going to create a new folder inside the js pages and inside here i'm going to create a new file name dot sorry home dot view okay save this and uh, Here we have progress indicator. I just am going to leave it for now. Finally update the resolve callback in your app. Realization to use import instead of require. So in the view of three we can use resolve the name and import pages. So if I come here, yeah, we have that one. And uh, now we need, I need to go in the web pack because we have installed the view. So we need to add the view here and hit save. Go to the terminal and run npm run dev. And we have an error. mix command is not found so i'm going to remove the node modules oh i delete here yeah. and run npm install and it's going to create that node module again
Okay, so if I run now npm run dev, we need to run, please run mix again. So we need to run again npm run dev. And now is everything is working. If I open the Laravel inertia.test, we don't have undefined variable here because we need to go in the roads web PHP and here we have return view but I'm going to return inertia render and it's going to render the pages and the home of the JS pages and the home component. Okay, so I'm going to create that. At the H1, welcome the Laravel inertia. Save and run npm run watch because it's going to we need make a changes and view app not found yeah because it's looking for the app not a welcome blade so if I change this to be app dot blade dot php and come here and refresh now we don't have an error but in the console cannot find module oh yeah we need only to say uh, home Yeah, now we have welcome to Laravel Inertia because the pages is inside the app.js, okay? We have pages here and the name of the component. So it's not, uh, it's not necessary to add it here because we have in the app.js. Okay, friends, hope you enjoy and I'm thinking maybe I'm going to create a new series about uh, to create an app with Laravel and Inertia. Hope you enjoy and all the best friends. Take it easy.